guys, welcome to Brew Review. I'm Corey. I'm Brady. This week we are bringing you Oktoberfest beers. Oktoberfest is in the air, so let's get down to it. Today we got the Spaten Oktoberfest. This is a beautiful little Marzen beer from Munich, uh, one of the originals, I believe. So the company's been around since 1397. They know their shit, guys. This is one of the oldest uh, operating breweries in the world, guys. This is really cool. So this is a Marzen Oktoberfest. Marzen meaning March. March as the time of year that would be the last time, at least in Germany and that part of Europe, they would brew beer as the summer would be too hot to do so. They let it ferment over the summer and towards the end of the summer they'd pop it open and voila, Oktoberfest. Oktoberfest was the last two weekends of September uh, going into the month of October. Really cool festival, uh, do it every year in Germany. We too like to celebrate Oktoberfest in America. So let's take a look at this label. Gorgeous green bottle with this crest looking piece on the front, old time looking font, and a sweet checkered pattern background. Let's take a look at this. Brown, clear, dark, amber. It's got this strong rust color going on. It's light lacing as it settles. Fingers worth a head. Finger, finger and a half. This is like the color of fall. Let's smell this. Yeah. It's pretty malty. Caramel sweetness going on too, definitely from the malts. Roasty, toasty. If you ever had like Turkish honey or like a buckwheat honey, kind of giving that little earthy sweetness aroma. I mean, it says right on the bottle, malt liquor. You know those 40s? 40 ounce beers, that smells like malt liquor. Yeah. I'm getting like a lighter tone of the, you know, but we could always play uh, Edward 40 hands, call it Octo Spot and hands. I'm eight of them in each hand. <laughs> we should dive in. Prost, guys. Prost. Happy Oktoberfest. Malty like it smells. It's got like this almost rye bread sort of spice to it. we we'll rye, rye bread and put some honey on it. Like honey cracker to me. This light, light bitterness coming through. Spiciness, I think, is coming from the hops as well. It's very nutty. This is really drinkable, man. You can crush a six-pack of this. This stuff is very easy. Easy drinker. A medium, medium bodied. Medium body. Very and smooth, though. I mean, it comes Good carbonation. In, it almost comes in at six percent. This would be fire with a with a nicely breaded schnitzel. Mm. Oh my and gosh. And some Brussels dude. sprouts. Brussels sprouts. Deep some fried Brussels some, sprouts. Some nice uh, red cabbage. Mm. Mm. I think it's really good, and it's very drinkable. I think I'm going to rate it a 3.9 overall. I think I'm gonna give it a 3.5. I would buy it again. If I went to a store and they didn't have anything but this, I would buy it. Not our favorite Oktoberfest, mm -hmm. but we think it's good and we think it's true to the Oktoberfest. Yeah. Obviously, since they pretty much are the ones who did it first. I think some people just have made better renditions of the Oktoberfest Mars and style. Guys, that was our review of the Spaten Oktoberfest Remarzen. We think it's really good. We think it's a staple in the Oktoberfest, yeah. and you should definitely get it. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you like the video, like it, subscribe. Follow us on Instagram and Facebook at Brew Review. Until next time, keep drinking. Cheers. Cheers.